Are you ready to rock and roll? Because I'm ready to rock and roll. Are you ready to rock and roll? Because I am ready to rock and roll. Therefore, let's go and let's go ahead and rock and roll. You know my squad. You know my squad. I said I ain't nobody messing with my squad. You know my squad. You know my squad. Subscribe squad, it's another day, it's another dollar, and it's time for another freaking reaction because that is what we do. You look at me and I look at you, you look at me and I look at you, you look at me and I look at you, that is what we do. Now before we go ahead and react to some more Led Zeppelin, I need you to do me a favor, I need you to hit that like button, I need you to hit that butt, sub button, and I need you to hit that bell button because you can ring my bell. Ring my bell, my bell, ring it, ring it, ring it. That we know every single time, literally every single time that I drop a new video, none of like that. But Scribe Squad, we have this goal. We're trying to get to 20k subs, 20k subs by the end of the year. And I know for a fact that we could do it. You know, I know that we could do it. I'm out here getting it. You're out here getting it. We're gonna go ahead and get it together and get to 20k subs. Now, with that being said, big dog, big dog, big dog. I got some news for you. News for you. News for you. No news for you. <laughs> yeah, I'm dropping a new single next week. It's called Let Him Go. All right. And it's coming out on December 4th. And so if you would like to pre-save that already on Spotify, so that way when it drops, it's just ready to pop, pop, pop up on your page. Go in the description below. Click the link. It literally says let him go. Pre-save. Hit that. Click that. But if you're a subscribe, and I know some of you guys are subscribes, and you want to hear that song an entire week before it releases. Mind you, I'm dropping a song and a music video next Wednesday. But if you want to hear that song an entire week before it releases, then just go ahead and go on my Patreon.com slash Cash. Any one of the tiers, you could hear that song before. Now, if you want to hear the music video, it goes up and up and up and blah, 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 blah. But check out the Patreon, and there's a whole bunch of benefits. Not only that, but I do personalized reactions based off of on my Patreon. Like, once you sign up for a tier, you can get a personalized reaction video to any song of your choice. Because like I said, you know, sometimes YouTube blocks these reaction videos that I film. Like, for example, Led Zeppelin Casimir got blocked multiple times. I tried to put it up. But if you're on one of my Patreon tiers, you're able to do that. Not only that, I'm just throwing everything out here so you guys have the information. There's no rush. My album drops next year, but if you're on a specific tier of my Patreon, you're going to automatically get my album for free. Yep. And you might even get a merch item for free. Let me talk about signed. Yeah, I know. Kind of cool, right? Okay, but it's enough about me. It is time for us to get back into this rock and roll. Now, like I said, we're going to start easing into these live versions now that we've gone through a lot of the main Led Zeppelin or the biggest hits, so so forth and so on, Led Zeppelin songs, right? So, today we're going to be doing the Immigrant Song live version, okay? Okay, okay, okay. And I'm, I'm honestly very interested to see what the differences are. Because you guys say this is supposed to be, like, way different. But let's enjoy this little visual they have, too. And, uh, rock and roll! Are they driving in?
I felt like I was at that show. Woo! My Oh my goodness. Okay, so was it just me or did it, did it feel like it was a little bit faster than the actual song? Like, and I felt like the bass was a little bit in a lower register. But then again, I think the, the studio version I heard was a remaster, so maybe it wasn't. But ah, uh -huh. and then at one point, them drums was going so fast, I could look, I got rhythm. I couldn't keep up with that rhythm. I don't know how he was hitting them licks. Them things was just boom, 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 boom. Just, I was like, whoa, and the guitar dude, like, oh my goodness. I wish I could have went to one of them shows. Can we, they need a hologram. Can we give them a hologram? If you y'all give them a hologram, I will go to that show. And I know they ain't dead. At least I think. I don't know. I'm a millennial. Don't be mad at me. But I want to see the hologram of them in a prime, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Oh, and I feel like they transitioned a lot faster and then the, what was in the song i feel like the song was like a lot more spaced out now mind you it's live music so you adapt to the feeling of what it is to do but like woo if i had to put one word on it woo <laughs> woo well yeah they had to be high performing that too because that was woo and i don't know how they was high doing that though like you know how do you do that and you already genius i guess i don't know because like i Man, that's just, it's just, that don't even make no sense. I'm like, how are you able to do that? Boom, 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 and his vocals sounded good live, too. Because, you know, like, some people... But back in that day, they didn't have no auto-tune. I know I'm so hyped up. you like, if you don't... This little girl don't calm down. Sorry. Put me on 10. Back in that day, they didn't have no auto-tune, so you had to be able to sing. And that's why I like listening to, like, old stuff. Even when I go back and I listen to, like, Marvin Gaye. Oh, my goodness. Marvin Gaye. Or, like, Whitney Houston, they didn't have auto-tune. Yeah, they had reverb. They had stuff that, you know, it can make it sound warmer or whatever. But you didn't hit that note, big dog. You didn't hit that note. <laughs> he was hitting his notes. Yeah, they had on some tight pants, though. I will say, them jeans is tight. <laughs> I don't know how they was moving in them things. <laughs> yeah, they had on, not even tight, they had on some suffocating pants. <laughs> I am weak. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so what I need you guys to do is, which live song should we do next? The live Led Zeppelin songs. Please let me know in the comments below. Just the live ones, because we have a list going for what we haven't already did. But the live Led Zeppelin songs, what should we do next? You know, make sure you get the titles. Hell, put links in there, too. Remember, now, Millennial. I don't know all the places that they've been performed at and what the best version is. <laughs> Please assist me, board for board. I love you guys. Do me a favor, watch another video on the channel. Hit that like button, hit that sub button, hit that bell button. But most importantly, have a great day. Gotta go.